on. It is 7.40 a.m. and we are on the way to the gym and it is 28 degrees out. <laughs> We're just, <laughs> I don't even know what to say. I don't know. We're just doing it. Okay guys, we finished our workout. It was deathly hard and it is now 8.52 and we've already finished it. So we're gonna go to like this pliable place to pick up some breakfast and then I'm having my lessons today at like 11. So that's kind of nice because it's not late in the afternoon. Okay, we got our pliables. It was really cute in there. Um, I got like a regular acai bowl with like granola, peanut butter, and bananas. And my mom got the same. And then I also got one of these like immunity shots because I sound a little stuffy and we've got a vacation coming up and I cannot be getting sick. So we're going home now. Okay guys, I made it back. I'm gonna take this little, it's called a ginger bomb. I just know it's not gonna be good. It's not like bad, like it's not a bad taste. It's just that it's so spicy. Oh, I'm going to eat this pliable because I don't need to eat before I go and ride. It looks amazing. It has granola, or it has acai, uh, chocolate protein, granola, peanut butter, and bananas. So, I'm gonna dig in and I'll talk to you in a bit. Okay guys, it is now 10.32 and I'm heading out. Um, it's kind of weird having morning lessons in the week because obviously when I used to be here in the week I'd be at school so they'd be in the afternoon but I'm honestly digging it so we're gonna head to the barn I'm gonna do my riding then we're gonna come home and pack for our vacation which I'm so excited about so I will catch up with you then we're gonna listen to Post Malone's new album Austin I absolutely love it so talk to you later good morning everyone it's actually the next day because I ended up not doing anything yesterday I didn't feel my best so I just chilled at home and really didn't do anything but it is now Wednesday and it is 6 like 20 a.m. I woke up at 6 hopped in the shower just got dressed in a workout set and I actually have a dentist appointment at 7 a.m. so that's where I'm going and then I'm gonna go to a workout class at 9 30 so I have to pack today for our vacation and I'm also gonna go get my nails and my toenails painted I think I'm gonna do like a light blue because it's like a beachy tropical place and I'm literally so excited I can't even explain to you um I'm gonna put a jacket or a hoodie on to go to the dentist it is kind of cold outside so so that's like the first half of my day and then the second half um I'm probably or not probably I've definitely got to do a little bit of YouTube work because I will be gone for most of next week so I need to get my main channel video completely ready. I will explain what our trip is today in this vlog, um, but I just gotta get going to the dentist right now. It definitely feels a little strange being up when it's pitch black out here, because like at school I get up and go to lift when it's pitch black out, but not at home. But like, I honestly think it's good for me to get up early a few times, because when I go back to school it's gonna be quite the shock so let's go to the dentist okay guys it's 7 30 um i'm already out i don't have any cavities so that's great um but i'm gonna head to duncan to get like a coffee and something to eat before i go work out but i am gonna go home first so let's go to duncan guys look at the sky this morning oh my gosh Okay guys, it is now nine. I climbed back into bed and watched YouTube for like an hour because I got back here and it wasn't even eight. So that's very nice, but I am heading out to go to the gym now. And now we can head out. I'm just gonna grab my phone, my water, and my coffee. Oh my God. The fact that I've got to go back to somewhere very cold. Dad said you're gonna get. Oh, I think you're getting a big dump of snow at the minute. <gasps> maybe. Wait, he thought <gasps> you might be getting. So you need to check with him. But. Me and my mom are on the way to the gym. I didn't even know what like day it was, but I guess it's Metcon, which is like a lot of cardio and abs. You said right. Core and arms. Core and arms. So everything but legs, which is great because we did legs yesterday and then I had two flat lessons. So my legs 
down for the count but me and my mom are also gonna go get our nails done later my nails are so grown out and they're also like christmas ones um and we're also gonna get our toes done because we'll be like barefoot pretty much the whole vacation so that'll be fun but it is cold and gloomy here today so okay guys it is 10 19 we just finished um i'm so sweaty that was actually really hard because it was like a metcon thing so it's a lot of cardio but we got it all done we're heading home now and then we're gonna go get our nails done in a little bit so i will catch up with you then oh hi baby it's so cuddly go get our nails done okay guys it is now 12 42 i we got our nails done mine are blue my mom just got clear on her nails and we got our toes done i'm not gonna show you our toes because there are creepy people on the internet but <laughs> <laughs> we went to Publix as well to get some groceries i got a taco kit for lunch so i will show you that now we are heading to cvs really quick because i really want to get like thick velcro hair rollers um a lot of people i've seen on tiktok use their dyson and then put those in and it just gives it this great natural look so we're gonna pop into cvs really quick and hope that we can find them found some um curlers it's like a big pack of them with loads of different sizes but they're like the velcro ones so you don't have to like clip them um my mom got some of her own because she likes to do just her front pieces but she got a smaller one because she only does her front pieces and then I also got some rosemary oil. I used to put this in my hair all the time. And at school, I actually use the shampoo because it's good for your scalp. It helps your uh, hair grow too. So we're gonna put all this in here and go home. Okay, I'm gonna eat my tacos. I'll talk to you later. Okay guys, I ate my tacos. It is now 1.33. I'm gonna hop in the shower soon because I just feel gross. I've been out all day and obviously I went to the gym and worked out. It was all sweaty, so I need to shower, but I wanna show you what else I got. Um, so I got this coconut um, scrub to use in the shower. I had like the Christmas one, but I used it all, so I needed to get a new one. And then I'm really excited to try this because I've seen a lot of people use this. It's the olaplex number three or n3 um i think you put it in your hair like after you blow dry it and stuff i'm gonna go shower and i'll show you when i do my hair and then we've got to actually pack for this trip and i'm gonna tell you about it okay guys it's now 320 i washed my hair and i've pretty much dried it i dried it like straightish um i'm trying to figure out how to use these because they're like supposed to stick to your hair but i feel like they don't stick that well i also realized the olaplex that i bought which was number three it said bond smoother but it's like a leave-in one that you then wash out whereas this that my mom had is like a styling one so i borrowed this but okay so basically we are leaving at like 6 a.m on friday and we are going to the u.s virgin islands if you guys have been subscribed to my vlog channel since last year, you probably saw when when we went to the British Virgin Islands and we basically went on like a boat that took us all over the British Virgin Islands for like a few days and we did that on spring break. So we are doing the same exact thing, but we're going to the US Virgin Islands, so it's slightly different and obviously like a different boat and crew. If you're interested, um, scroll back to my vlog channel a little bit i have like literally daily vlogs from when we did that and it was literally the best trip we've ever been on so really excited um this time my boyfriend's going with me so i'm sure you guys will meet him in some of the vlogs um but we leave here at like 6 a.m or something friday because last time we stayed in a hotel at st thomas then got on the boat the following day whereas this time we're flying in and getting straight on the boat so i'm pretty excited i'm also doing these inwards because that's what the girl on tiktok did so hopefully hopefully it works okay you can't really tell because my hair is dark the rollers definitely gave it like a little bit of 
like volume and a little bit of curl but definitely nothing crazy i think that's just because i've got a master how to do it first so i'm going to just add a little more curl to this and i'll talk to you after okay guys you probably still can't really tell because my hair is so dark but what i ended up doing was air wrapping all of it like with the actual curling part and all that i put in the rollers were like the front parts and the two front sides and then the rest of it i just air wrapped out and i think it looks cute okay guys now that i'm like looking at my hair obviously it's like clipped back but i'm actually really pleased with how it turned out like there's definitely some good curls there i think the key definitely is like blow dry and everything like i did but instead of trying to do like a million curlers i should just do the front pieces like air wrap them and put in there and then the rest of it you can just kind of curl i do have to get dressed but I'm going to start packing for vacation. Okay, friends, I got changed. I'm just gonna keep my hair pinned back because it's out of my face, but we're gonna go ahead and pack for the US Virgin Islands sailboat trip. They pretty much like give you a list suggesting what you should and shouldn't bring, but I do also remember from last year, obviously, that you pretty much live in swimsuits. So I'm mostly going to just pack swimsuits a couple of dresses, maybe like, you know, a t-shirt and shorts to wear if it's something casual, and some PJs. So it's going to be super, super quick packing. Um, so let's just get it done. Also, it has to go in this kind of odd looking bag. Obviously, any duffel bag will do. We got these last year for our trip, and obviously, you're just going to use them again anytime we go on a trip like this. But they're duffel bags, and they're waterproof because... Once you land in St. Thomas, you actually have to take a water taxi, I believe, to where the boat picks us up. So it's much easier to travel with soft cases and also then you don't have to find somewhere to store on the boat. So they suggest you bring a duffel bag and I just happen to have a waterproof one. So we're gonna put it in this. And it looks huge, but it has to fold over to keep the water out, obviously. Okay, for dresses, which are pretty much the only clothes I'm going to bring, I'm going to bring this like tight little dress and it has like a cutout in the back. I'm gonna bring this blue and white striped dress with this little bone back. I've worn this a million times. So it's this really cute little yellow dress and it has cutouts in the side. And it'll be cool because you'll see what I'm packing and then you'll get to see in the vlogs and like photos and stuff what it looks like when I wear it. So, and then this white dress, this looks a little crazy, but basically it's a dress, but it ties back here. So there's like cutouts in the front and obviously like an open back, but it is a dress, even though it looks all wild. Okay, so some of the bikinis I'm bringing are kind of in a tangled mess. So I'm gonna sort that out in a second, but I'll show you the, the parts of them that I can. So I'm taking this bikini, the top is tangled in that mess, but it's like, it's like these peaches on this green bikini, so super bright. I'm also just taking a red bikini, this brown and blue one, and then these are the new ones. So I have this, this brown bikini, that's the top, and then this white one. I think this actually is probably my favorite. Again, this one's new as well, so I haven't had a chance to wear it, but it's white and it's got this like blue pattern. It actually matches my nails, that's so funny. I'm gonna go untangle the other parts of the swimsuits and be right back. Okay, I think instead of taking this tight dress, cause I probably won't wear that, um, I have this top that I wanna bring. It's like a little white, um, cute open back top. And I have this long like flowy brown skirt. I think I'm gonna take that as an outfit instead cause I think I'll wear that more to be honest okay then i also can't pack all my toiletries yet because obviously some of them i'll use tomorrow but i'm also excited because i've got this new um toiletries bag because i obviously travel so much now that i'm at college coming back and forth so i can fill stuff up and the only thing i need to remember is this sun bum face mist this is the best stuff ever especially if you're not a fan of like sunscreen and stuff because you can just put this on every day it's super easy so i'm putting that in there before i forget i will talk to you when we're heading to cj okay guys i did a bit of editing and now i am heading out to see jane i have this 
Montana like sweatshirt on with some jeans and my Nikes and then this like fuzzy really thick plaid coat because it is quite chilly out so it makes a great day for some ramen <laughs> I'm just genuinely so excited for this ramen. It's so like dreary. Like, you know what I mean? Like, yes, there are places that are much colder than Atlanta in the winter. Like, it's really not that cold. Although it is cold for Atlanta. Like, the 20s is cold for Atlanta. However, it's the fact that it's just like dreary out. Like, it looks creepy. It looks weird. So I'm really excited about this ramen. Um, yeah, and then I'm gonna come home and really edit <laughs> that is the plan for tonight because I've literally filmed so many main channel videos to pre-film for when I go to college that I'm a little bit overwhelmed with all the footage so that's that and I've got to f edit this vlog so okay guys thank you so much for watching this vlog the next vlog will be of us heading to St. Thomas and getting on the boat and basically our first day um, I'm going to make daily vlogs, or at least I plan on it. However, I don't know that I will be able to upload them while I'm there because obviously we are on a boat in the ocean. There's probably not strong service. There wasn't last time. So I will edit them all <laughs> and post them when I get back. So stay tuned for that. But I am posting every Monday on my main channel. So be on the lookout for that. I love you all so much and I will see you very soon. Bye.